what they plan to embarrass you God will use it to embrace you Amen I remember the word of God in the book of Isaiah chapter 60 verse 15 whereas you have been forsaken and hated so that no one is traveling through you the word of God says I will make you beautiful forever hey! we are as you have been despised and hated with no one traveling through you what does that mean you have been despised and hated you have been rejected all the days of your life you have been expressing rejection your family members have been expressing rejection you have been despised and hated but the word of god says i will make you beautiful forever Amen. in such a way that those who rejected you in future they will regret for making such a mistake your enemies will never regret forever raising an accusing finger or accusing mouth at you Amen. my children the scripture says in the book of isaiah 52 rise up from your dust that dust is a place of shame that place is a place of humiliation that place is a place of rejection that place is a place of sorrow rise up that place is a place of what rejection and what god said rise up and sit in a place of honor remove the assyrian yoke that yoke is a satanic bondage in your life and the scripture said sit in a place of honor after this message my god is taking you somewhere amen the stone with the builders rejected shall be the chief corner stone David was a rejected stone, but he later became the chief corner stone. In Judges chapter 11, the scripture made mention of a man called Jephthah. Jephthah was a rejected stone, but one day God remembered Jephthah, and Jephthah became the chief corner stone. To the extent that someone who was rejected became a king over his people. They have no option because God has remembered your family. I say they have no option because God has remembered you. Message of God is coming your way. According to Isaiah 64, Isaiah 54, verse 4. The word of God said, You will no longer remember the shame of your youth, nor the sorrows of your widowhood. Shame is coming to an end. Mockery is coming to an end. I remember the story of Hannah. One day, the mockery of our sister Hannah came to an end. Do you know that Hannah was productive more than Penina? message That we put to an end your shame. Amen. 